Woo. What's up, y'all? This is JD from Bar Guy Never Again saying what's up. Man, it's playoff time. Uh, we play against Morocco today, actually, uh, for the start of our semifinals. Man, it's gonna be a tough one. These guys are hungry. They're probably, this is probably the best team assembled on that squad to date. They got inside, they got outside, they got shooters, slashers, defenders. It's gonna be tough, so um, not that we take them for granted, which we don't, but today, um, I'm just gonna kinda show you guys what I do, what we do as players to get ready for the game. But first, I, I wanna show you my room because uh, they decided to give us our own rooms. Ah! So uh, I wanna show you guys my, my room now, my little setup. As you can see, I'm a really clean guy. I got the fridge out here. I got the phone. I got the phone here higher so that I don't have to bend down and reach the phone. It's it's like a thing, you know, I don't like to bend down too much because it's like my back and I'm old and stuff. Um, just got some laundry here. Here's my little gaming gaming station right here. Um, I got to do a uh, film session with my guy Drew and Jake. Um, they're going to be on here in about 10 minutes. So we're going to basically go over goods and bads of what happened last game and things that I need to work on. But uh, this is it right here. This is the room. Here's my little coffee area. This is my favorite coffee right here. Oh, I mix this coffee too with it. This is this is the business too. I mix this coffee with that, and I put this in here too. MCT oil, good for the brain. Whatever gets you right. Uh, usually on game days, um, I really don't do too much. Just uh, I'll wake up, I do some stretching, mobility work, and when I say mobility work, it's just it's like extended stretching you know it's it's nothing too crazy I have my little normal routine with my coffee and, and breakfast same breakfast that I've been eating for three weeks straight pretty much do some film study once we get to the arena we really don't have that much time to activate the muscles get the proper pre-work movement prep in so I do it literally here in the room um, it looks it looks silly but uh, you find ways to make it work. And once you kind of, you know, as a player, once you get a routine down, you just stick to that same routine. And you just, that's all, that's all it really is about, is just having a solid routine and sticking with it. So that's what I've been doing since I've been here in this bubble. And it's been helping so much. I mean, for, for you guys don't really, that don't know my story, you know, I've been injured for damn near two years, two and a half years maybe three, maybe three, where I'm just in and out of these injuries. And it was so fun, not only frustrating to me, but it was frustrating to my teammates, frustrating to the organization, um, coaches, this, you know, where I would play one or two games and I'd have to sit out a couple games, try to heal up as I can, as much as I can, then play a couple games and sit out a couple games. And it was tough. It was so tough on me mentally. Uh, I wanted to retire for a little bit. It's just all the pain that I was going through was, wasn't worth it. Um, you know, people second guessing me if I was really injured or not, that wore on me. Got in touch with this guy, Jeff. Man, he's, he set me right. We found out what was wrong with me. And ever since then, um, I, I'm okay. And now I'm so humble. <laughs> I am so grateful to be playing like every day that I play I'm so happy just because just two those two or three years when I was just not in a good place mentally and physically um and fast forward to now about where I'm at and, and how I change my body and just being in the rotation helping the team win some of these games it's the best feeling in the world it's the best feeling in the world. So um, 
God, I love this game so much. And I'm so grateful at the same time. I'm hooping still. So uh, I'm having a lot of fun out here. I have a lot of fun talking to you guys, sharing with you guys my stories and and what we do here as players and getting ready for these games. So um, yeah, that's about it on that one.